Hey, good morning, Heath. It's Jeff. Just got your message. Thought I'd give you a walk around video here of the 96 F-150. Just want to let you know, so I haven't detailed the truck at all. Um, this is exactly how I got it from South Carolina. All I've done is, is wash it up. Um, so typically, I don't know if you can see, there's a couple real light marks in the paint here. These are things that I would typically polish out before putting the vehicle up on eBay. I also did notice in the hood, yeah, you can see that. It looks like there was a bird dropping that uh, wasn't wiped off in time. Now I'll do my, you know, if, again, if I have to list it on eBay, I'll go ahead and I'll try to polish that out and do what I can. Um, the way I'm offering you the truck is as it sits with the new tires if you wanted those. If you didn't want the new tires, um, you can see that there is good tread left on these Uniroyals. I just thought with a full wheel drive that uh, the 31 1050s would look shit hot on this thing. I'll back up and just give you an overall, overall view here. Again, one family owned truck out of Walhalla, South Carolina. Uh, all the trim is really, really nice. You can see the chrome is good. Window trim. I'll be honest with you, the window trim on this truck is cleaner than the two wheel drive that I just sold that you had interest in. Couple real light marks, you know, in the tape there. Um, I looked this truck over and over again this morning, and I am comfortable stating that this truck has 100% original paint. Notice in these bump strips, um, they start to discolor a little bit. Super common, even on low mile trucks. That last one that I sold had that too. Things that I would typically do if I listed something on eBay is I would um, steel wool these these bolts or just replace them with stainless moving around back here got the original dealer plate from Edwards uh, old Ford and Jeep out of Wahala where it was purchased new I called Edwards and they only had a few service records on the truck and it was already stuff that I had um, notice here on the bumper, a little bit of a pull down here. There was something mounted underneath. I don't know if it got bent, you know, or something along the way, but there's a minor, minor flaw there. And then, you know, some of the marks on, uh, on the step portion of the bumper. Rear tailgate piece is so freaking gorgeous. You know, I had an NOS one of these once in a box, and I got fifteen hundred bucks for it. That's that's no BS. Coming around here to the driver's side, I'll go ahead and back up just so you can see the whole truck. You could see earlier. I'll zoom in on the tires, but the tires that are on here, I'll be honest with you, man. I think they might be original. Uniroyal Tiger Paws were. Um, were factory tires one of the options you could get on these trucks and notice I don't have a tread gauge but there's decent tread left the only reason I bought those other good years is because I thought on a 4x4 the uh, the 31 1050s would just just look badass so again just gonna pause kind of let you let you look. Um, I want to stress that I'm offering you the truck as it sits. Uh, based on what I've gotten for the last two short beds, um, I'm pretty confident, Heath, that I, I'm, I can pull low 20s out of this truck. Um, thinking about 23 or so right in that ballpark. But if I don't have to go through uh, the eBay process you know and put together the ad and things like that um, you know we could 
we could do a deal that way if, if you were comfortable. Um, I think I just showed you a picture of the roof. I'm sorry. I'm thinking about getting the air conditioning going and making sure I had a, a thermometer and things like that. Hey, notice too that uh, truck still has all of its all of its original Ford glass. So, you know, front windshield hasn't been replaced. The truck was babied, man. Just absolutely babied since it was new. Couple, couple minor, minor dings. Maybe not on this side. Maybe those are on, on the passenger side. Damn it, I thought last year I saw a couple dings when I brought this thing home. Huh. It's funny, hey, when you gotta look this hard. I mean, as you can tell, if I'm looking this hard, there, there aren't many. If any, I. Okay, man. I guess I guess there aren't any dings. Hey, I'm gonna go ahead and uh, show you the interior, under the hood, and uh, we'll fire this thing up. <laughs> 